Are you a goody goody gamer? You know, the type that always chooses the good choice. It pains you to hurt somebody's feelings, even in a video game. Well, what happens when you meet someone who's beyond help, like this guy, or especially this guy? What I'm trying to say is, help me help them, because this guy is about to get left in this hole. Hi, you guys, and welcome to the Shane Caravan. In today's video, we're back with more Tears of the Kingdom. Let's get this guy to his friend. It looks like it's a straight shot, but we know nothing's ever that simple. Never an easy escort mission. Okay, well, there's a dude walking, so it can't be that dangerous. What can I do? <laughs> I mean, really think about it. If you were just walking around, minding your own business, and you see a dude literally just stretching out his hand with like this magic stuff coming out, carrying a giant Korok with a backpack, would that make you question your life a little bit? Just be like, you know what? I don't think I'm doing enough with my life. I think, I think I could do more. I think I could be a better person. I think I could something. <laughs> you know what I mean? This makes you start to question your life and your life choices. Mm -mm -mm. I did it. Thank you for bringing my friend. He's something for you. Yeah. yeah. Bye. <laughs> They're so cute. <laughs> also gonna take all of this. Now I'm wondering what's back that way, because I never went that way. Oh, it's, what's his name? I feel like this was the way I was supposed to come, and I just came this, like, weird back path. I already know. I already know. I'm grab a board. Are they different every time? That would explain a lot. I can't imagine it would be the same one every time. Now you should be able to let it go. Try letting go. I don't know if that's close enough. Dang it. <laughs> I'm sorry. I thought it would be more stable. Bruh. Oh, it took my stuff away. Okay, it's just over here. So finicky. That still might work. Let's try it. <laughs> Should I let him go? Yeah. Okay. Okay, so I see the issue. It's because it's got like a triangle board space. So it's like a point. So it needs to be supported like around the bottom, not the top. So what we're gonna do is it needs like a box around it, if that makes sense. It seems to only fall in that direction though. So I'm like, maybe it'll be good. Let's just try. <laughs> just let go and see what happens, bro. I'm sorry. <laughs> It's not my fault you got some like shoddy stuff. Okay, and now put that up against the wall and see what happens. It's, it's too janky. No, what? Screw this. I'll come back to this later. Let me just, let me put a little, uh, yeah. I, maybe that's why they put the little person stamp there. Okay, we'll come back to you another day. I got time for that. <laughs> what is up there? Ooh, that looks like baddie beds. I'm trying to get to the bird place. I want the shrine, but also I'm at that point where I'm like, bruh, I wasted so much time on that one, dude. I can always come back. It's a rickety bridge. Yeah. Okay, horse. Horse, I need you. I need you to calm it down. I wasn't going towards the hole until you stopped mid, you know, gallop. Goodness. Uh, I saw the bridge over there, but I guess I gotta go through here. Is that him again? Bruh, how are you everywhere? Put another stamp. Who's that? I think that's another Rito guy. Is that a Rito? Yeah, okay. I wasn't sure at first. It's training time again. I'm gonna train again today to become an all time great Rito warrior. <laughs> Huh? Who are you? Someone else who aspires to greatness? Ah. Guess you heard my little pep talk to myself, huh? Talk about embarrassing. Nah, I'm all about mantras. You do this. You do you, boo. For us, Rito, our ability to control the wind is one of our big advantages to fighting monsters. That's why I train here every day. Aren't you curious what kind of training I'm talking about? Mm. Of course you are. I guess I am if I walked all the way over here to talk to you. I use these sweet wings of mine to return the balls that fly at me, push them back one after the other. What do you think? Want to give it a try? I'll pass right now. I'm guessing he tosses them. That's pretty, oh my God. It's pretty cool, bruh. Ooh, this looks familiar. Like, wasn't there some place like this in Breath of the Wild where like up top there was like ruins and a shrine, guardians or something yeah. around it. There's some baddie beds that away. So we're gonna go this way. 
Come on. I just wanted to get around them. I also want these spicy peppers, because if we go into a cold place, then more than likely I'm gonna need them. You don't see nothing. You don't see a fan. Hopefully this is where I'm even supposed to be going. I think so. Maybe. I think lots of rocks everywhere. Uh, shoot. He's also on a horse. No, he's not. He's just chilling. Oh, God. Ooh, what is that? I'm actually very curious in this. How'd you get stuck down, bro? He probably needs my help to get out, huh? Oh, he's is he playing an instrument? He is. Okay. Ugh. Oh, hey, did you come down here to rescue me? It's a rescue. Uh, Why, thank you. I was heading to Rito Village, which is suffering through a fierce blizzard to cheer them up with music and supplies. I got my wagon going at a pretty good clip on the road. But then I suddenly drove into this hall. It's never been here before. Uh, the horse I was riding ran off somewhere and my cargo was spoiled. Only thing I have left is the wagon. Uh, I haven't figured out how to get both me and my wagon out of this hole and I won't leave it behind. She's me stuck here, plain and simple. Uh, I'm relieved that someone came to rescue me, but <laughs> I hope you have a plan to free me from this hole. Eustace. I'm more like useless. <laughs> Am I right? Okay. So where's your wagon? Ah, okay. Oops. Picking up what you're putting down. I'm gonna put this on top, like so. I'm gonna take one of these. Sorry, bud. <laughs> y'all gotta learn to watch out. Y'all see magic happening. Y'all need to back the hell up. That ain't my fault. Attach. I don't like that it's on the side like that. Hmm, I'll have to see fans. And a flame emitter. Oh. So, that won't hurt us, right? I hope not. Maybe I need both. So those look pretty hefty. I appreciate the music while I'm doing this, though. I can't climb up the walls of this hole even if I could, blah, blah, blah. Get in the wagon. Okay, I was about to say. You can actually make this happen? Yeah. All right, then. Let's hope you know what you're doing. Let's hope we not know what I'm doing. This could be a hot mess. Huh? There's nowhere for me to sit. But, bruh, if you don't, just... Oh, my lord. Oh, God. That's not what I wanted. It was the freaking admitter. Because homeboy needs somewhere to sit. What? What if I put it up here? Out your way. How about that? Okay, now. You got a whole... A whole seat. <laughs> Where do you need to sit? You can sit right here. Sir. You don't want to be safe, do you? Can I like put that there, right? And then grab that, right? Can it go on top of the flame emitter itself? Maybe the other air balloon is throwing it off? what I get for trying to be a nice person. Okay, now, how about, how about now? I swear to God, if you say that you don't have a place to sit, where the hell did you want to sleep? <laughs> there we go. Uh -uh. All right, let's see if this works. Um, we did it, hot, sorry. Uh-oh, is that gonna stop us? Oh no, how am I out of charge already? Sorry, I love how we're on the ground. Oh, too dangerous. I'm falling out. Bruh. Hey, be more careful. <clears throat> and I will pull myself together. Do I need to also use these or something? Whoop. Bruh, I'm so, so done with the shenanigans. There's one. Oh, wait, how do I hit everything? Sorry, bruh. You really need to just watch out. I actually attach it to the other fan. Yeah, that feels better. There's two emitters, so that's why I'm like, I think I gotta use both. Oh my god. This angle. Oh my god. Also not helping. Okay, put it on one side. Like that. Grab the, the balloon. Put it on top. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Grab this one. Come on. Come on. Oh my god. Do. Oh my god. This camera. Alright. Not you. <laughs> Definitely not you. I got literally everything I can on this thing. Attach. Uh, it's still a little. I think the issue is these guys. Need to put it a little bit closer. There's one. So now we need 
There we go. All right. Oh, my Jesus. Get in. <laughs> yeah. I don't like the sound he makes, like, bro. Oi! Okay, so, that's dangerous. Will it take off without me if I... And then, oh God, oh God. Ah. Uh, Oh, too dangerous, I'm falling out. I don't know what to do, because I can get him up, but like, how are we supposed to, like, where are we supposed to go? Hmm. Bruh. Screw you, Andrew Wagon. How the hell do I get out of here? I ain't got time for none of this. Bye, bruh. Thanks for the sweet tunes. 